Uh, today we release the uh, first images of the black hole at the center of our galaxy. This is a four million solar mass behemoth sitting at the heart of the Milky Way. This is the first images that show its event horizon, convincingly proving that it is in fact a black hole. Before this, we knew it was four million solar masses. We didn't know what else it could be. There's a big difference between not knowing what else and what it really is. And so this is the first time we've been able to prove that there's black holes not just out there in the universe, but there's one at the center of our own galaxy. Sag A star is now the second black hole for which the Event Horizon Telescope has been able to resolve the event horizon, that point of no return. Coupled with M87, this really forms an odd couple, a couple of extremes. M87 is a six and a half billion solar mass black hole in an extreme environment, a very massive galaxy, and launching light speed outflows. Sagittarius A star, by comparison, is really the black hole next door. That's a black hole that's common in the universe, the hearts of typical galaxies. By comparing and contrasting how they appear uh, and how they interact with the gas around them, we can begin to uncover the mysteries of how black holes extend their influence across the universe. The images that we see today are a culmination of years of effort by hundreds of people spread around the globe. There are eight different telescopes which need to detect and observe with nanosecond precision timing, uh, incoming radio waves, collecting that information onto literally tons of hard drives, which are then shipped to supercomputers to complete the process of forming the image from this Earth-sized telescope. 